let's go to the mall and get boyfriends. Let's go to the mall and get maybe girlfriends. Whatever you're into, ba 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 ba. What up, nerds? Today we are traveling back in time to the 1980s, the decade that I was born in. Believe it or not, <laughs> literally all of my life has been devoted to the pursuit of hair volume. I remember being a little girl and my mom making me stand in front of her in the mirror and she would take a round brush to my like little short hair and try to give me volume. But the moment I have any kind of shape, it just dies. What, okay, what is this doing? Hold on, give me a second. When I think of the 1980s, I think of perms. Like I feel like everyone had perms. Madonna had a perm. I know my mom had a perm at one time. Should I get a perm? No. So I'm gonna watch some YouTube videos that talk about achieving that 80s look. Um, and then I'm going to be using a vintage styling tool to see if I can give my hair the volume that she deserves. You've used the styling product before, right? I didn't use it, but it turns off. It turns off. So this is an 80s rocker hair tutorial. Exactly what I want. So what I'm learning from this video is extreme side parts are huge. I think I'm definitely gonna go for like the brushed side thing here and then lots and lots of volume here. I've learned three things from these tutorials. I've learned that you need to um, slightly abuse your hair. You need to rub it a lot, like rub it so it makes this weird noise. And I think that's to just kind of get it some texture. I've learned that we're gonna have to tease. Today, we are using this, the Speed Styler. Leftover from the 70s, which I'm sure women in the 80s definitely use. Look, is that Farrah Fawcett? It is Farrah Fawcett. Oh my gosh, okay. Uh, wow, this smells like my mom's basement. So this is essentially a hair dryer, yes? That you put like a comb into. Our producer, Megan, found this speed styler from an antique store in Seattle. We're gonna use it on my baby hairs. But first we're gonna wet it. If this works, Megan, I'm gonna take this home with me. background history for you. Where we're going to is the coldest bathroom on campus. It's freezing in here. Do you not feel it? No, this is the worst bathroom. It's the worst bathroom to poop in, but sometimes you have to. <laughs> Am I doing it? Step one, get yourself to look like a wet dog. Step two, Walk your sorry butt back to your set. Step three, stand underneath the heat for a second. <laughs> Step four, <laughs> have joy scare the living hell out of you. Maybe that's the secret for hair volume. You just gotta have, be scarred. Yeah. Your hair jumped. Yeah. Full volume. <laughs> Devin needs help. Like this is oh. Kind of oh, yeah. Wow, Megan. Look at this, okay. <coughs> I'm just gonna let it air out for a bit. She's smoking. Just a little bit. All right, towel's off. Okay, you're definitely getting that little 80s hair bend up. You see that? That little, that little curve? I think we're getting there. Let's go to the mall. I don't hate it. Wait, do you see that? I don't know if you know this, but I think that's called volume. Really, I'm making this video for the people who don't know how to do hair, like myself. I'm sorry if I'm lost soldier. Did we break it? It's not turning on. Because that's gonna help. <laughs> no. I killed her. My hair killed her. That's what happened. I killed her. Oh my gosh, she's dead. Yeah. Should we hold a funeral? This is what this is like. My first. <gasps> What? 
You think she's haunted? Do you have a Ouija board in here? <laughs> no, I don't have a Ouija board. I barely have a hair dryer in here. It could be haunted. It could also just be overheated. We're back at it. Let's go to the mall. Am I doing it? Oh, wow. So it smells like burnt hair in here. Um, probably because this thing is older than I am. Wow, this thing is older than I am. Respect. She's off again. Look, this looks pretty voluminous, right? All right, so teasing your hair. Teasing 101. You just grab a piece and you just go like this, right? Let me reestablish this side. 80s part, there we go. Oh, I like the art form of teasing because you're essentially just making chaos in your hair. And I appreciate that. You're creating problems and then smoothing it over and then not talking about it. Problems, 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 talking spreading gossip, spreading gossip. No, it wasn't me, it wasn't me this entire time. I'm innocent. Wow, this might've actually worked. Wow, is she gonna turn on? She's back, she's back. Oh, look at that bump. Look at it, it's a hill. All right, as it stands right now, I'm kind of looking like a, a pissed off soccer mom. And I'm trying to look like a pissed off soccer mom from the 80s, okay? Then we're just gonna spray it. Am I beautiful yet? <laughs> we've teased her, we've heated her up, we've put her in warm temperatures. Now I'm just gonna start to mistreat her and just give her a little texture by pinching and rubbing. Pinch, she's pinching, she's rubbing. She's pinching, she's rubbing. You know what you look like right now? Who do I look like? You're looking less glam for faucet and more the mother from Edward Sister. They're both from the 80s though, right? I never promised to look glam. I just promised bo body, you know? I can't help if my crazy <laughs> comes out. Is it good? This is good. I'm just making uh, land masses with my hair, which I've never been able to do before. Thank you, Speed Styler. I think I went to sleep in 2019 and I think I woke up in 1989. So we're here for the long game. We're gonna see how long this hairstyle lasts. If she doesn't last that long, it's my hair's fault. If she does, it's the speed styler's fault. Looking pretty good, Meg Ryan, look at that. <laughs> it's not as poofy as I thought it would be. It really actually is more modern than you're, you'd expect. Your hair is looking good, by the way. Thank you, I just got a haircut. It kind of looks like bedhead. She's, she looks like 80s hair though, right? Like 80s bedhead. Yeah, yeah, like if you went to bed and woke up in the 80s. We did not promise 80s glam. We just promised that it'd be 80s hair. Yeah. I don't think I'm mad at you in this, because I get that it's, you're trying something, you're doing something. I'm, Curly's not mad. Do you know what I mean? Like you're trying something. I, you're just supportive of me trying something new right now. Yeah. But if this was like you being serious, like you were like, this is my new look, I'm being serious about this, I'd be like, oh, maybe let's reconsider. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> wow, what fun. I actually styled it with an 80s tool called wow. the Speed Styler. What does the tool actually do? It turns on when she wants to. Mm -hmm. It smells like your mom's basement. Uh -huh. And she heats up your roots so that you get more volume. Do you think I could use that? Curly, if you want, you can. <laughs> so I just walked by one of our HR reps here at BuzzFeed and she gave me a little bit of a, her gaze said to me like, I know it's a Monday, but are you doing okay? <laughs> It's been about, I would say, two hours since the volume was injected into my head. It's definitely fallen. She's fallen. Look at her. Look at her. It's... I told you this would happen. What are you gonna do? So, it's the end of the day, and as expected, she's a little tired. She's wilted. Um, but, you know, I, I learned a lot today. Um, I'm definitely going to be stealing that hairstyler. You know what, I am happy that I was able to achieve the volume of my dreams for at least part of the morning. So traveling back to the 80s to find my perfect hair volume, lady tested, lady lifted. I'll tell you one thing, 80s hair is not great for the environment. <laughs>